was a song from the most western part of Denmark, now known as England. <laughs> We're talking 1,200 years ago, you know. So, uh, no, it, it's uh, a piece I like to throw in there because uh, it's kind of a neat piece by the verb called Bittersweet Symphony, and it's a really stringy piece, you know, um, and, it, and it's nice playing on this violin because this is actually a violin from London that I just got this year, it was made in 1945 by a man who fought in the First World War and got injured and then um, it actually limited his ability to make violins but he still made about 500 of them and he had a special tool because he couldn't use his arm the right way so he had a special tool to compensate for that so that's, that's kind of an interesting story and I, and I love this instrument and I also feel like um, I owe you a little bit of an explanation as to what's going on up here because obviously I'm just one instrument, but I'm making it sound a lot bigger than that. It's kind of a one-man band kind of thing. So what I'm using here is a loop station, this gray box over here. Some of you may be able to see it's called the boomerang. And just like with the boomerang, whatever you throw out, 
kind of comes back at you, whether it's good or bad, so you better make it good the first time. It's known as live looping. This guy, Ed Sheeran, is known for doing that full stadium shows where he'll just be a one-man band kind of show. And I have many opportunities, and everything is done live, so whatever happens here, it can be erased. And I'm matter of fact, I'm going to erase this loop I just did right now. With the push of a button, it's gone to never be recovered. Made rest in peace, that sad loop. <laughs> and besides that, I also have some of these effects pedals here on my left side, which alters the sound in a hopefully a, 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 a smart way for what I'm playing. For example, here's one without it. And with it, kind of see how that drops the signal down and not to make it possible for me to play bass line. sounding stuff. <laughs> I can also go up an ox instead of down. <laughs> Sounds a little bit like a ukulele maybe or a steel pan, steel drum, something like that. Um, so got different opportunities. I was using this one, this last piece. known as a delay pedal delays the sound but I can actually preset how much delay so I can play the delay in time with the piece I'm playing which is kind of interesting and then perhaps my favorite effect is this one known as an envelope filter sounds a lot like a wah-wah pedal that Jimi Hendrix would use back in the 60s this however is activated by the use of my bow. This bow is made of wood and horsehair, and that's how I get the sound of violin. I the harder I press, you get that sort of effect. <laughs> kind of fun. <laughs> 